Hi, this is Mike. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to do a handwritten test in Blackboard so that uh, students can take the test and the faculty member can grade the test. So the way we're going to do this first is the student is going to um, handwrite a test, however that happens. So if the faculty member prints out the questions and then the student needs to answer them on a piece of paper, um, that's what will happen. So I've got here a piece of paper that I've written some text on. Uh, so here's my exam. So I've written something in Russian here. And what I'm going to do is I need to download an app to either my iPhone or my Android. Uh, and there are two apps that we suggest. We suggest for the iPhone, we suggest something called Scannable. And for the Android, we suggest that you use um, Adobe Scan. Um, I don't have an Android, but I'm going to show you what it looks like on Scannable. Um, and hopefully I'll be able to put some resources on how to use Adobe Scan to save a PDF uh, and send it to yourself as an email as well. But I'm going to take you through how to do that in Scannable and post that to your Blackboard site as an assignment right now. So here, let me share my uh, iPhone screen with you and I'll go to my Scannable app. So here's Scannable. And it's going to look for a document immediately. Don't let it find a document. First, we need to um, do some settings on it. And if I click on the three buttons here at the bottom left, you'll notice that I have some settings here at the bottom left. And if I click on settings, uh, you'll notice file type is auto. I want to change it to PDF just to make sure that it gets the right file type. And then I'll go back. And now what I can do is I can find that, I'll say done. And now I can find that document that I wrote and I'll hover over the document and you notice it finds the edges and it takes a picture and that's it. Um, and now I hit the check box here at the bottom right and I'm all ready to go. Okay, so now here it is, it's a PDF and I'm gonna hit share. And I'm just gonna share it um, to my email. I'll click on Outlook here and I'll send it to myself. And it's a PDF as, you know, make sure it's a PDF and I'll say send. And I'll say send. All right, now I'm all done with the phone. I'll go to my email next and I'll check and now I can upload that uh, to my Blackboard site. So now I'm back here in my webmail and you can see I've got this email to myself and I can download that. Notice that it's a PDF, that's what I'm going to need. Uh, if I made a mistake and saved it as a PNG file, then I'll need to scan it again as a PDF file. Um, so I'm just going to hit download. And here it is. And I can save it, whatever I want it as. I'll say save as. I'll put it in my downloads folder. Homework one, save. Oh, it already saved it, so I'll replace it. Why not? Um, so it's all done. I can close it, Acrobat Reader here. And now I need to upload it to my Blackboard course site. Um, so I'll go to the Blackboard course. And in this case, I know that the um, the area I need to upload it to is in the assignments area, but that may vary depending on the course you're taking. And I'll click on Assignments, and here's my new assignment. And I'll click on New Assignment, and here is where I'm going to browse my computer. Find that PDF in my Downloads area, or wherever it is that I put it. Hit Open, and then hit Submit. And now here's my written text and I'm done with the submission and now the next step is for the faculty member to uh, grade it. And that's all there is to it.